Good morning, 20 to 5 and all packed up and ready to go. I camped, I camped in the forest tonight, nothing special to show, so, and here, yeah, ready to go. So this is cool place just out of the golf and holiday park. I'm leaving the village or town. Everything is closed, it's just too early, five o'clock. It's, it's definitely not the opening time for the majority of the businesses. So. The barracks. Fantastic time of the day to film it. She've got opportunity for a really good meal. I just had cooked breakfast for just 7.50. And if you ask about the weather today, yes, it's Scotland. On a day like today, very hot one and it's just past nine. I really welcome the prospect of walking in a forest. Only 15 kilometers left to go so I estimate not more than four hours so before two o'clock I should be done with East Highland Way. Yeah! That's pretty neat. that this kind of track will will continue for a few miles and 
I was able to charge my power bank a little bit so I can film till the end. That's good news. I'm not rushing but to be honest I, I would like to finish as soon as possible because the sun is is getting unbearable and well in the sections like like the one I'm just starting it's uh, you know it's a open field and the sun operates and of course Wears it down much quicker, so hydration is the key. Beautiful weather, beautiful views, and I'm roasting like on fry pan. This is one of many examples of things that would not ever ever happen in Poland or Italy for that example and that because people would just pick it up before it's rotten in the countries I mentioned it's very popular to uh, to do mushroom picking in the forest and, and just cook them you can dry them you can pickle them, you can do oh, so many things with them and they are very tasty. They are completely different than the, than the mushroom you can buy in UK, in, in Tesco, you know, the, the white ones. Uh, completely different thing. I'm, I'm amazed that nobody in the UK is, is collecting them. In the forest. Same with uh, same with blueberries. This is, I guess, uh, one of many differences in traditions in different countries. But really, you should learn about uh, forest mushrooms and try some. So I'm out of the forest, or kind of, and going this rocky path. Surprisingly good, good walk. Just pushing through. Only eight kilometers left to Aviemor. Seven k to Aviemor, and trail become extremely busy. So as I'm get close to the finish of this Highland Way, let me summarize. It's definitely hugely less popular trail than West Highland Way. Less glamorous, uh, much worse way marked. The way marks are only the second stage, I think, along the Loch Lagan. Um, what else? The best part between Lagan and Newton Moor. Definitely the most beautiful part through the bog. Just beautiful. I will do it again anytime very enjoyable trail not very physically demanding very good for beginners very good for training for bigger trail I've done it in four days all the plant six um, I've seen people cycling the trail so so I met, in total, I met 
six, seven hikers and three cyclists on the trail through four days of hiking. That's amazing. This is this is the number of people you meet at any stage of West Highland Way. So <clears throat> really good place. I don't believe that you can walk it uh, without without any food. But there are places you can eat and there are places where you can sleep so and and there's no bigger issue with finding camping spot so yeah really good trail so once again thanks a lot for watching thanks for tagging on thanks for walking with me till the next time Leaving the forest and starting roadwalk. Last stretch. There's no official start and finish of the East Highland Way. I think the railway station is the best place. So that's me checking out. Till the next time.